Here we have Happy Fish Bar and Grill and Happy Goat Coffee Company. Okay, so it can't be a coincidence. There has to be a connection. This used to be a different bar and grill. I forget the name, um, but it wasn't that. And then that's been there for a while. It replaced a Starbucks, and then this became a thing. So that's a chain. Uh, there's a few other Happy Goat Coffees. That's the only bar and grill I know of, but maybe it's the same owners. Uh, it's gotta be. And I just have an issue with the name. Um, Oh, is my lens dirty? Here, I'm not going to start again. I'll just wipe the lens here. How's that? Okay, so, happy goat. Conceivable. You know, I, I guess the idea would be that uh, they make, I don't know, they have goat milk um, that they put in the coffee. And a goat would be like, all right, that's fine. You know, I'd rather give the goat to, to my kids. And I think baby goats are literally named kids, so that's what the goat would say if it spoke English. Um, and... Uh, you know, it, but, but it, it would be like, uh, you know, it, that's fine. I'm, I'm still alive. Uh, you're not serving goat meat at the coffee shop. Uh, there's no goat sandwiches. It's fine. I'm happy. I'm happy. Happy enough. I'm happy to have a job and to uh, have my name on the coffee place. The happy fish, though, uh, I, I, I don't know if you saw, the, the fish on the logo was like, ah, very happy. I don't think that is possible. Uh, for, that would be the least happy fish, I would think, because they do serve fish there. I'm sure they're not serving fish milk or just fish eggs, and even fish eggs, the fish might be like, well, don't serve my eggs. Although chickens probably don't mind eggs being served. It's not like an actual baby. Anyways, that's a whole other political discussion. But anyways, um, yeah, I, don't, I just don't, I don't see the fish being happy about being eaten. Although I guess a caveat might be that they only serve the happiest fish. Like the, they find the happiest fish that's like, ah, I'm so happy to be a fish. I'm so happy to be alive. I, I love swimming. And then that's what they catch and kill and eat or serve at the bar, which would be even sadder. I mean, that's a bad situation. I mean, it would be better if you found the saddest fish. And then, you know, because then he doesn't have much to live for. You're actually maybe putting him out of his misery. Like, I feel like I'm the sad fish. It's like, I, if I were a fish, I'd be like, you know what, please, serve me, serve me at your restaurant, and at least I have some purpose in life. And then I would become a happy fish because I'd be like oh you're gonna kill thank god yes and I'd be like yay it's all over just before they killed me and ate me um, so maybe that is what it means maybe maybe they're actually serving the saddest fish but making him happy by eating by serving him and eating him it's all very complicated I just I feel like happy fish might be a better name for like like a really big aquarium where they have lots of fish toys and and like maybe like you know it's like a dating pool and, you know, there's boy fish and girl fish and they all get to hang out and that'd be a happy time. That'd be the happiest fish. But then why would it be a bar and grill? Because, I mean, unless it was a bar and grill with an aquarium of fish where the fish are like, this is awesome. Uh, they don't eat fish here. We're just playing in the aquarium. And, uh, and, then, and then they serve burgers. And so it could be like the happy fish and sad cow bar. Happy Easter, by the way. There's a happy, happy uh, rabbit. See, the rabbit's happy because we don't eat rabbits on Easter. We eat eggs. And so it'd be like happy, uh, bur what do you, what do you call that? Happy rabbit and sad chicken. I don't see any sad chickens right there. What is that? Oh, there's a sad owl. Anyways, I feel like those people are probably like, who's looking in my window? And look, happy frog. See, happy frog with a girlfriend. Oh, oh that's like a double date. Well, hello. Grenouille, that's French for, for frog. Anyways, that's my deep thoughts on the names. Do you think it should be called happy fish? Do you think it should be called Happy Goat? How's your Easter? Happy Easter.